Good morning, guys and girls. It's about 7.15, Saturday, March 3rd, I think it is. We are going up uh, Baldy Trailhead to go ski Mount Bald or Baldy. Um, we're gonna skin up backcountry split board. I guess side country, technically, it's not too intense. We do have our Beacon Probe Shovel, so always good to have that, it is turned on. Um, got the dog, too. So uh, yeah, we're gonna head up. You park right at the top of Mount Baldy in this trailhead right here, a parking lot. It's pretty easy to get to, pretty easy to find. It does fill up. I actually got a ticket last time for parking on the town road. So make sure you're in the parking lot and not off the, <laughs> the side of the road. So yeah, we're gonna ski up and, and uh, have a really good time skiing down. It looks like they got a ton of snow. Everywhere is getting pummeled this weekend. So let's get after it. See ya. All right, guys, we're at a nice little checkpoint here. Um, this is called the gate. I'm not sure if anyone else calls it that, but there's, there usually is a gate here in the summer or winter time. Um, you can actually motorcycle up here. You can see highway legal vehicles only. So, you know, no, no dirt bikes make them street legal, but uh, it's a lot of fun to ride up here. Um, really challenging and good rocky terrain. So it's a good, good place to kind of open the vents up, uh, you know, get the dog a treat, have some treats for myself, some beef jerky. So. I've got some Willie Nelson 311, uh, Dave Matthews in the headphones, so it's a good, good variety. We're gonna keep trucking. All right, we'll see you up there. So this is sort of where the easy stuff stops and the uh, steeper stuff begins. So we're gonna go ahead and click up into our higher setting in the uh, Spark R&D bindings. It's a signal split board in case anyone's curious. Um, my first split board, I think it's great, no complaints. Uh, thanks for the uh, contest win outside TV. Got a free split board because we won a video contest, so that was pretty cool. But yeah, uh, dog's doing good. He's got some snow in his face, but we'll get him some more treats. He's been doing really well. Uh, get myself okay. some beef jerky. We'll keep listening to some Robert Earl Keen. Thanks, Dad, great, great recommendation. Um, and then yeah, we'll, we'll finish this out and. The fun part's yet to come, so stay tuned. Making progress, but it's slow and steady. <laughs> Gotta tell you, I've seen one guy in the last hour and hour and 15 minutes, hour and a half maybe, and because of his tracks, I'm able to go so much faster. If he wasn't here, I'd be dogging it about probably halfway between here and that mill that I showed you earlier, so. But uh, yeah, I mean, look at, <laughs> pretty much hard to beat. Dog's doing some pulling probably 4% power whenever he feels like it in the right direction. So it's uh, interesting, but um, we're side hilling now, kind of going zigzag. It's pretty steep and this is really powdery. So again, I gotta follow this guy's tracks or I'd be half as fast. So we're getting closer though. I can see the top and we will uh, keep pushing on. Right, guys we are almost at the very very top well very skiable top uh, a couple weeks ago we aimed for that nipple there so we're gonna go a little bit left to that I just saw a guy go down a second ago so it's gonna really help to stay in his tracks um, but I'll probably take about 20 minutes up top to kind of catch my breath eat some beef jerky and so I like to close my vents up now the last five minutes before I get to the top to keep that warmth inside so um, that's a good little, good little tip and trick might help you out to stay warm up there. It just takes a while to turn the skis into a board again. So take your time. There's no rush. Uh, make sure you're covered. You can almost see the resort way down there. Straight across is probably peak eight to the right's peak seven. So um, doing pretty good. This looks like a great area to ride. I bet we'll have easily six to eight inches. Come on, Duke. Come on, bud. And so it's going to be a really fun ride. I'm actually worried about even having enough speed to get down. So 
that'll be the biggest concern for this trip, but uh, good problem to have, I guess. So, uh, all right, let's do it. We made it. Uh, four people joining us down there. Duke's going crazy. He wants to get out of here and start running. He's going nuts. He's going nuts. But it's all right. We're gonna go. We're gonna head down here right now. Let's do it. Well guys, thanks for watching. Uh, Duke says thanks too. That was a lap on Baldy. We are back in the parking lot area, right about Meow. You can almost see the resort way down there. Dead ahead of it looks like the uh, base of PK. Let's uh, call that a success. Thanks again, see you next time. Good boy, buddy. Duke, Duke. Good boy, good boy.